Connecting QSFP DD and OSFP modules has always been a challenging issue. If the switch is equipped with QSFP DD ports, and the NVIDIA 400G Connect X7 OSFP network card uses OSFP ports, and can only use 400G OSFP flat top. Electrical signals are for times 100G PAM4. This will make it difficult to directly connect the switch and the network card, causing a lot of trouble for network layout and upgrade. To solve this problem, we have launched several solutions. The 400G OSFP NVIDIA CX7 and IC can use the 400G OSFP SR for flat top optical module. The optical signal is for times 100G PAM4. The 400G QSFP DDS or 8 optical signal is 8 times 50 G PAM4. So the 400G QSFP DD switch can only use the 400G QSFP DDS or for optical signal which is also for times 100 G PAM4. So the first solution is to choose the QSFP DD 400G S or for module at the switch and use the OSFP 400G S or for module at the server. SR for means short distance transmission using multi-mode fiber. For means for optical channels. Both modules use 100 G PAM for modulation and use OM for multi-mode fiber. The solution is more suitable for short distance connections within or between adjacent buildings. In the data center, the SR for module is relatively low cost and provides an economical choice for building high performance networks. The second solution is to choose the QSFP DD400G DR4 module at the switch and use the OSFP 400G DR4 module at the server. DR4 means 500 meters transmission using single mode fiber. For means for optical channels, both modules use 100G PAM for modulation and use single mode fiber connectors. The solution is more suitable for connections between data centers or long-distance internal connections. The cost of optical modules is too high. Is it possible to use active electrical copper cable to convert 50G PAM for times 8 electrical signals into 100G PAM for times for electrical signals in short distance? Transmission of 1 to 3 meters. Our team is developing an innovative product that provides an unprecedented solution for this problem. Please stay tuned.